皆さんこんにちは私の名前はヴォイレンです<笑> Today I will be talking about some good and reasonable cheap books with also some more expensive books for learning Japanese especially for self-studying When I started learning Japanese I really didn't know where to start I started with hiragana and katakana but then I was like from okay where now? And that's why I'm making this video for helping you self-learners to study Japanese in a better way. So I will go from the cheapest to the more expensive ones in this video. So if you want to spend a little bit more money on decent books, probably skip a little bit later on in the video. The first resource book thing I want to talk about, I say book thing because it's not really a book, it's a newspaper. Having a Japanese newspaper, well, let me first say, if you are really serious about learning Japanese and also want to be able to read it, having a newspaper can be quite useful because if you can read this, your Japanese is quite good because they use too much kanji. Honestly, I can't read anything, like some characters I know and the hiragana and katakana I know, but Next up, some books for elementary school students. Except for this one, this one is more like, yeah, not sure, it's just a couple of sentences. These books all come from the Hyakuen shop Daiso in Japan. If you're going to Japan and you want to find a cheap way of getting some books for learning Japanese, I would suggest Daiso. Only one dollar, 100 yen, for each book. And these books are about, um, vocabulary and these are about kanji but they're also for like first grade <laughs> but that's quite good because my Japanese level is still quite low however if you're not in Japan right now or you aren't going to Japan anytime soon those books will be quite hard to get in your country probably these are some of the books of Mina no Nihongo but like you can see, you don't really see much English on them and when you open the book there's no English at all. That makes those books quite difficult to recommend to self studiers because you will need a dictionary like the whole time for translating the questions and it's quite a pain if you don't know hiragana and katakana yet so I I want to recommend them but only to like the very serious learners who are willing to invest their time into translating every single thing but only in the beginning you will have to translate them because later on you will improve and you will be able to read them without any problem. If you're also still studying Japanese and you have some recommendations of books on your own, please leave them down in the comments below for the other self-studiers to see. So you also help fellow companions into the quest of learning Japanese. Over the course of the next following months or maybe years, I will be making more videos about self-studying Japanese. So if you want to see more, please click the subscribe button that's left or right I'm not I think here yeah yeah press this this red button on there over there 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 it's under the video <laughs> good luck learning Japanese